And so begins this segment of What's Cooking with Good Looking. Yeah. Today we are cooking chicken. Breasts. Now, the first step to cooking anything is you have to eat a snack while you're cooking. It helps with the cravings. Also, cerveza. Step one. Get your rice cooking in the rice cooker. That way, by the time all the other stuff is done, the rice is done. Because this is the bed. This is the bed that goes into the Tupperware containers first. Okay, so we put two cups of jasmine rice into the cooker. Put three cups of water in there too. And now, close it up. Yeah. And then you press, press the button, boom, and now it goes. Like I said, snack. Make sure it's healthy, cause we're healthy. See, even Chapo knows what's up. Snacks, man. Makes the world go around. Okay, so we're gonna cut up this chicken. And then, we're gonna add all this veggies right after I wash my grubby hands with my renegade grease release. Yeah. Okay, so now we are going to cut up the chicken chi cheese. Get them cooking. Okay, so now that we have a pile of pollos, we're going to put it in this giant container because, to be quite honest, gentlemen, size matters. Put it into this pan. And okay, so now that we have a pile of chicken titties diced and sliced and ready to cook, we're going to put it into this pan. And it's a big pan because contrary to popular belief, size does matter. But for this particular time, I'm making my meal prep for this week. And since my pan is not big enough compared to others' pans, I'm going to be doing half at a time and doing it twice. Yes. So, we're going to use half of it and put it <laughs> Ta-da, Junior! Okay. I would say that is about... Okay, that's about half. So we're going to get that nice and settled in, ready to go, and then we're going to add half of the bag of Oriental Stir Fry. Okay, so now we're going to add our veggies. And since I'm too lazy to go and find scissors. We're going to use our teeth to open the bag. Maybe. Possibly. That. <laughs> Clearly, I have zero patience. It works, whatever. Okay, so now we put the veggies into the pan and throw them all around. Just like that. Yes. It's a beautiful blend of it greens and reds and yellows and whatnot and it's quite delicious so now we're going to stir all around and then put the lid on to make it sizzle beautiful and it's blueberry time don't judge me that i eat blueberries with beer Balance, remember? Also, I forgot to mention, when you open this pack of veggies that you can get at your local Walmart, be sure to take these little packet dealy bobs out before you go dumping it in there. Otherwise, these land in the pan. Yes, it's great. 
But for this cooking video, I don't use these because, as I said before, we're trying to be healthy. Also, be sure to stir it every now and then. Otherwise, you're going to get it singed on the bottom. So, maybe uh, speaking from experience. Hey, you live and learn. Rice is done. Okay, so now the next step. You gotta make your little bed of rice in all your Tupperware containers so that when that is done, it can get topped on top of the bed of said rice. Okay, next step. Line out all your little things, just like when you make muffins and you put little cupcake cups in there and, and whatnot. Get your, all your little dishes and containers ready. You gotta put your rice in all them. Okay, so now, put your little rice in all your little containers. Yes, yes. And then, you come over here. Maybe. Flip around! Okay. Ta-da! Delicious! Delicioso! As Dora the Explorer would say. And then we're going to scoop this and then put it in each and every one, a little daily bobs like that. Yes. All right, all right, all right. So since that was only half cooked, remember, since we didn't have a big enough pan, we put them in five of those, and now we have to fill those five that are left. So we're going to repeat the same process again and do another one. Tony is my bae. Oh, he's so handsome. Look at that stud. I got me a sugar daddy in the form of seasoning. What now? So I've actually had quite a few of y'all ask if I was going to start a YouTube channel. And I've kind of been up in the air about it because I don't know if I can handle all of the social media that I'm already currently trying to deal with and then add a YouTube channel on top of it. But then it got me thinking and I was like, you know, screw it. Why not? So if y'all think I should start a YouTube channel, please vote yes or no on the last video. And then I will make my decision based on if y'all will actually watch it or not. Currently stirring my veggies. Thinking about whether or not I should start a YouTube channel or not. I just don't know if it'll be worth it. And who would watch it. I don't know. And that is a lot of video editing. Oh my gosh. I can't even imagine. Okay. So. Stirring my veggies and my chicken. And really wondering if I should or should not start a YouTube channel. I don't know. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of time. It's a lot of video editing, which I already have maxed out my iCloud storage on my phone between photos and videos and screenshots. Thank you for all the idiots from Blast of Mondays. You have taken up my entire storage on the phone. Bruh. Anywho, we are now going to put this beautiful stir fry into these here containers because they're looking a little sad. Yeah. Okay, so now it's time to put the tops on them because they can't be naked in the fridge, otherwise they spoil. So, we're going to put tops on all these. <clears throat> Call it a day. But anyways. Yeah. And just like that, my job here is done. Toodles, everybody. Have a blessed night. And that completes this session of What's Cooking with Good Looking. Yeah.